I couldn't even see that. Interesting. So there's another room there and another room here. Or there? Maybe not. Definitely there though. Hey, cat, speak up. Uh, pet him. This seems very invasive and I don't like it. Really? We're gonna go with the previous mechanics? I don't mind being touched, but cats have their own boundaries. Yeah, but I don't get anything for doing this. Surely you don't think this pendant is my true form, do you? Dude, you have so many problems you don't like me touching. So he only likes his chest. And that's it. Okay. Uh, about these books. Fascinating, no? These books have all been infused with the mysterious power of the symphony. They can be activated using the melodies of the music box. Well done. It looks as if you can now skillfully manipulate this musical might. I was right to put my faith in you. There are many books like this song in the castle. Back in the day. Nay, let us not dwell on the past. I believe you're fully capable of discovering the mysteries within. Okay, moving on. I didn't look at this window. We must respect the windows. Ooh, that's a lot of colorful fishies. Oh my god, this place is so big. Need a bookshelf. Well, there isn't one here. Or is there? No, no, there is not. Ooh, same as the picture from before. Ah, uh, but where's number two? I've missed number two somewhere, guys. I'm assuming they're chronological. Regario's notes, <sighs> number three. I already completely understand everything. Well, that makes one of us. Humanity has no need to, nor should they, control any knowledge beyond their abilities. In a way, it is not people who pursue knowledge, but knowledge that pursues people. I have an idea. It's one I never mentioned to the Golden Hunter before he left. Why not rebuild the long-abandoned town of Petrichor? We can attract refugees to live here and spread other versions of the legend. This way, they will actively protect the rebuilt seals, and the secrets of this place will be forever... Seals, you say? I feel like I shouldn't be tampering with some things. Hi again! It's a strange shiny fish again. It looks more like a whale. Front whale, back fish. Feels like it's been following us from outside all this time. How weird. Paimon, have you witnessed so little of the world as to find such things strange? Are we not underwater? It's not ordinary to see all manner of fish about. Eh, but this big cat looks anything but ordinary. And this voice, I've heard it before. Seriously, you mean from the dream you had before? <sighs> this part of the sea outside is like the castle. It belongs to the past. It is something that should have been forgotten. If one ceaselessly calls out to a monster that has been blotted from memory, they might yet jump out and cause trouble. It is wise to be cautious. It is for the best if we simply treat it as an ordinary fish. You make everything sound so scary, Aura. Are you just trying to creep us out or something? I simply mean to avoid unnecessary complications. After all, our top priority is to retrieve the surface dweller's souls, no? It just so happens there's a blank score before us. We simply need to use the music box to tune the auto-harmonic reed pipes on either side, and we can obtain it. Oh, so I need two scores then. Give it a go. But I don't have any scores. An auto-harmonic device built by an ancient civilization obsessed with music. It must be tuned to the correct mode using the power of the symphony. As you hold and unleash it plays sound waves, the soundboard will keep sliding. Okay, whatever that means. Release to cause it to point to the, at the specific note. This will cause... Oh, this thing moves up. Okay. This will allow you to change the tuning, but how do I know what the correct note is? Once a set of autoharmonic reed pipes have been properly tuned, 
the note floating above them will change. As to what the correct note is, you might be able to find clues nearby. Okay, good, because I have no freaking clue. Okay, hold up, Sparky. Well, that's not a clue. Ack. Ooh. Secret locale of the ancient order. That's a nice angle. Can I get a picture from that angle? No, because that shit doesn't exist. Hmm. How did you... How, did you have, like, a wide-lens camera? How did you get all of that in one shot? I certainly can't remedy that. Uh, sorry, mimic that. Hmm. He's waiting for me. And I'm here playing with... Oh, this is going to be in the picture. Never mind. Anyway, scores, you say. I still have not found anything for a score. Do you have a score? Negative. Uh, nothing up there. I don't see anything on the ground level here. Oh, do you mean these things over here? Uh... Oh! Oh, that is so bloody on the nose. I thought it was going to be more in-depth than that. It's just this has to match that. And then this has to match... Like, Could you have not made it more complicated? That's way too basic. Anyway, off you go. That's so easy. So sad. What do we have here? Treasure. Treasure your love. Am I just ignoring the other way, kitty? If you say so, extract. Continue exploring the Faded Castle. Oh, that can be the blank score. But this score is totally blank. It looks like we won't be able to play it with the music box either. What are we going to do with it then? If there is nothing there, that means that any melody can be written upon it. Oh, it's like a fresh slate. We will be able to make use of this. Bye. I go. Bye-bye. Go find this goddamn hydroculus that keeps dinging. Oh, hush you lot. You ding when I say you can ding. Okay, so this other one must be down there somewhere. Oh god, it could be anywhere. Let's just take this one bit at a time. Let's go over here. Ah! Where did I come from? I came from down, right? Okay! I don't know where you're gonna- you're gonna leave me. Yeah, I'll come back for you. I remember you exist. Oh boy. Okay, we are back where we started. Oh, will we find any firework materials in here? Okay, well there's actually nothing here. We'll go back and get that page when we go downstairs. But now, we're going up. Music is very interesting. Ah, hi. I apparently got a book I don't even remember. This music, hi. It's fantastic. It's so, I don't even know, it's deep. My guiding stars, cold. Holy shit, how big is this place? Oh, you can reduce mine chunks for me. That's so accommodating. Thanks. Does that count as mining? Ah, <laughs> uh, hold on. Let me see the chest first. What do we have here? Investigation of the Northern Barbarians. Oh boy, we're gonna be here for a while, guys. Buckle up. Let's go. 
there have always been various misunderstandings regarding the northern barbarians. These misunderstandings are not conducive to conquering and pacifying them, nor are they beneficial to the long-term well-being of the empire. For these reasons, I, Hertir Hertius, the Vicarius of Legio, Legio, again, I don't do like Latin pronunciation, Legio the sixth Rithimi Versi, in accordance with the exalted Hermost Eurges, Eurgesius, Fuck me, I don't do this language. I barely get through Asian languages. I don't do European. Universally known benevolence and authority, hereby faithfully record all I know for posterity, so that future successors may fulfill their duty to safeguard the northern border with less trouble. Society. Again, I'm assuming northerners does relate to Fontanians, but I could be wrong on that front. The social structure of different chiefdoms vary dramatically. Most chiefdoms are still in the state of rudimentary clan-based societies, with councils composed of clan chiefs holding the highest authority. However, the Monica tribe has long ceased to be an accurate descriptor for some chiefdoms. Though many are loath to admit this, we must face the fact they have broken free from primal barbarism. For example, before the polis it's very Greek of you, of Lugdunensis was raised by Legio V. Its population exceeded, how's that for posterity? As a trade hub of many northern chiefdoms, its degree of prosperity could favorably be compared to, the rule of the area did not call themselves a chieftain, but a holy king, and they believed their authority to rule came from an ancient sword bestowed upon them by the mother of many springs. Naturally, any rational citizen knows that strange women lying in ponds distributing swords is no basis for a system of government. I concur. Supreme executive power derives from melody and harmony, not from some farcical aquatic ceremony. I think both of those are farcical, but you do you. How'd that work out for you? Oh, that's right, you all died out. I see how it is. Another example is ruled by a council of astrologists, and they use, I'm going to assume that's Mondstadt, uh, to set apart young children. Actually, not Mondstadt. Uh, where did, where's the Hexa, Hexa what's McCordy come from? Or are they not country specific? Hmm. I don't remember. I don't do history of this world. Uh, da, 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 da. Elemental affinity, raising them to become, and these people can nearly rival our legions in battle. That is true. The witches of the uh, council are quite strong. Note by Marius Servius. The city mentioned here has already been subjugated and raised by the exalted Hermos Boethius. Its name erased from memory. That's tragic? Is it like a Canrian era city, perhaps? In the past, the conquest of tribes still in primitive state could be completed simply by dealing with the clan elders of each clan. A few decades ago, the exalted Hermost Aurelius successfully concluded his northern campaign through such methods, without even resorting to violence, simply by dispatching legionnaires to announce the conquest. P uh, uh, okay. <laughs> the various insular tribes on those remote islands were incorporated into the empire's territory. Seriously? They fell for that. They're not very bright, are they? However, following the conquest of Aramorica, such tribes grew fewer and fewer. Different methods ought to be used to pacify different chiefdoms. Just as the exalted Hermost Yergesia once said, it is because they are ignorant savages by nature that we must first understand them before they can understand us. The following pages have been erased and cannot be read. Beliefs. Today, the belief that the barbarians of the north worship a false god, or evil god, known as the mistress of all waters, is widespread. However, this is a fiction created as a result of the conquest of Aramorica. Its leader had forced other chieftains to acknowledge that their gods were all aspects of the mistress of all waters, regardless of what god they originally worshipped or what names they had. In other words, the barbarians of the northern Borden region do not have a single centralised belief system. Even to this day, they do not have a unified understanding of the concept of the mistress of all waters. The leader of Aramorica seemed not to mind this point, as she only demanded they worship the same name without prescribing the contents of their beliefs. How does that work, exactly? Regardless, blood and but Actually, in a way, that's really smart on the part of conquering other nations by going, hey, I'm not going to change your religion. You can still worship as you always have to the entity you've always revered. But just know that they're actually an essence of the mistress of all waters. So in essence, all along, you've been worshipping our deity. <gasps> but we'll allow you to continue what you've been doing of all time and know that you are serving our goals. That's actually really smart. 
Regardless, blood and barbarism pervade their belief systems. Some scholars believe this is because they never received a response from the gods. They can only resort to increasingly violent and extreme sacrifices to prop up their false beliefs. Showing them the mercy of the Sebastos is meaningless, for mercy is regarded as weakness by the savages. The correct approach is to point out to them that the Sebastos can easily defeat their false gods, and only Sebastos is powerful enough to be worthy of worship. The following pages have been erased and cannot be read. Aramorica, great. I want more information on this place, so let's go for it. Once an obscure and unknown tribe, but today the center of power in the northern border region. Its former ruler, Cunoricus bent the knee to the empire some 20 years ago. As for its current ruler, the infamous Erinyas! Erinyas? <gasps> really? We know little indeed. I suppose I probably know more than you do. From captured slaves, we have learned that she is not the heir of Cunoricus. The latter did originally have a son as well, named Caius. However, we are unsure when and how she became the ruler of Aramorica. Regardless of how she claims to have been blessed by the false god, she has never demonstrated any abilities surpassing those to be expected of an ordinary mortal. Everything she has done so far amounts to nothing more than using insidious plots and base treachery to commit abhorrent crimes against the Empire and its citizens. I mean, you're at war with one another, so I can't quite take your word for gospel and also you're at war with each other so you know you are going to be committing things against the other the other people only those who are utterly helpless teetering on the brink of death would choose to believe in a woman proclaiming to be able to hear the will of the gods and flock to her banner just as the exalted homos you fire out this bloody name you just you you geisha said she simply doesn't believe in any god at all for none with faith would commit such atrocities in the name of a god Note by Marius Servius. The name Erinyas is suspected to be the result of a careless error when it was first transcribed, for this name has no meaning in their language. In the script of the people of bygone times, the symbol for the sound y looks quite similar to y, and so was copied as such. There is precedent for similar mistakes. The proper pronunciation of the name should be Eregenth of Aramorica. The language of the people of bygone times, er signifies high, while Rienth would be the feminine case of ruler. So the high ruler of Aramorica. So it's a title is what you're trying to say. It's not a name, but a title. From this perspective... Oh, that's literally what it says. Sorry. <laughs> I was just reading through its logic and going, okay, so it's a title, right? <laughs> but it says it here. From this perspective, the name is perhaps not her praenomen, but rather a title. However, since many scholars already refer to her as Erinias, there is no need for me to assume the authority to revise it. I like being educated like this. Give me more of this. I'm going to forget it in two seconds, but I'm thoroughly enjoying this. My throat, maybe not so much, but I like it. This place is big. Hi. A place through the uh, bookshelf. Oh, maybe up here is just considered through the bookshelf. Everything else is just normal society. And I can just get to it as I normally would. Okay. Okay. Ha! Part of me wants to just go get it because I can see it. And I am up high. But the rest of me is like, nah man, just go back the way you came and approach everything organically. Oh dear. Oh, we missed that by quite a mile. <laughs> Oh, you made it. Thank God. Whew. Look at these the, the, the blah, 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 candelabra. I like that you've got greenery draping off it. It's been unsafe with the flames and everything. You must have some like continual flame spell happening because how else do you have so much magic flame? Also with the dripping water, it must be magical flame. Um, I have a thing for chandeliers, by the way. Always have, always will. I love chandeliers. Can't explain it really. Oh my. Thank you. All right, so that is that. Down we go. So we did this part and now we continue this way. Stop beeping at me, gosh darn it. I will get to you when I get to you. My word, you're impatient. You too, stop beeping at me. Can I sit and investigate? 
I sure can. Oh, I thought I was going to read. Never mind. Completely unnecessary. Stage of faded gold. But where do you sit to watch? You can't just have up here. And there, and there. You must have a very small audience. Okay. I probably will jump down. Oh, but it's so far down. Maybe not. Oh, I can just fast travel back up to this point. Yeah, we're jumping down. But can I get it from this angle? It's probably the better question. Will I be too low? Nah, yeah. Son of a bitch. Is this the stage you spoke of earlier, Aura? A Paimon's eyes deceiving her, or is the mural on top still moving? It's kind of spooky. That terrifying power couldn't be escaping from here, could it, Aura? Hey, Aura! You spacing out? Meow? Ahem. <clears throat> My apologies. I was distracted for a moment. Did you once perform on the stage? Is that why you're feeling uh, nostalgic or something like that? Did you play a cat? Perhaps you're an audience member. Seems unlikely. I might have, or I might not. It was all in the past either way. Utterly irrelevant. What matters now is the state of discord I smell in the air. As though some presence, one that makes me uneasy, once visited this place. I fear that specif specifics may only be ascertained once we perform the score here. There's one here too? Pamela didn't notice. Well, you may have seen scores shaped like strings, but you have not seen those shaped like murals, one such as before you. Oh, so the pictures are moving because it's actually a score. Yes. Did we not find a blank score before? It is now time to perform it. Please, do the honours. I hate you. Go jump. I was in a very clear trajectory. I'm gonna go from this side. I think I might have more luck. Uh, up, up and away. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Glorious primer gems. Yay! And of course, you know, we're going back up because I didn't finish exploring. Ha 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 ha. Or it can wait. Okay, so that's the way down. Oh, books, books, books. You don't seem relevant. I should go get that book from downstairs, shouldn't I? Ooh. Ooh. Yay, we got part two. I feel like I'm getting ahead of myself. Gentlemen! Oh, sorry, there's only one dude here. My apologies. Hi. The night How is are you doing there, sir? Frozen? Yeah, that but sounds about right. I spend my name flights pretty cold as well. It's okay. I won't hold it against you. It's called winter. Well, autumn technically. Bye. I wonder who uses their loot. But suck to have to kill a bajillion of them for leveling. What do we have here? Loot. Anything behind? Oh, it's like just rocks. Oh, this looks like we go further into the castle. I feel like I'm getting ahead of myself. Ooh, book. Time for a light Over. show. No, this one. Where did it go? There it is. Okay, I am prepared when I come across another bookshelf. Oh, you're here. And there's the bookshelf in question. Oops, I got ahead of myself. Whoopsies. Ooh, oh, let me I open it. Law. Give me law. Give me law. Ah, this is not law. This is pain. Why are you not activated? Not now. Stars shine for me. Yes. This may be a little more troublesome than I thought it was. Wind, hear me. That is what the healing is for. Yeah. 
How on earth did we... Did we... Hmm. Did we never immune you? Oh shit, the other guy's ready. Ow. trying to miss the night is cold get him Don't to miss scared. but he got me on the back swing let the world come alive fuse is lit ha <laughs> 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 frozen <laughs> not for long though all righty that was busy is it just the chest no no floor no loot oh will we find any firework materials in here Okay, that's something. Oh, hello. <gasps> what is this? A sword? Oh, it's just a billet. It's okay, I'll take it. Someone's notes. Through these methods, the quality can be pierced, endowed with the form of the substance. Similar to Remus's ancient authorities, stripped away, placed within... This way, it is possible to recreate once more the perfect harmonious symphony that belonged only to humanity that played before their utter downfall. No more gods. Only man can rule over man. Substance and property are not important. Quality is what determines the essence of things. The object... Mm, I don't know if I agree with that. The object that plays the music, it could be the strings of a harp, a sword, or even... As long as it is an object bestowed with meaning, anything. This sword, forged from the bones of to honour the memory of the noble, I am not reading that name again, had Vovos colla Vovos's collapse not caused her music to sing, oh, Vovos is a female, to sink into the sea of pandemonium, we could have together. For a moment of madness, he betrayed us all. The false god's will was like a weed floating upon the water, unable to rival that of humans. But that matters not now. In the end, humans alone shall be saved, if only. The following lines have been brutally erased and cannot be read. I did not understand a word of that. Like I was reading a foreign language. Fire hazard. <laughs> Wait, there's something next to the cat. Hold up. Check. Oh, it's part of a musical score. Too bad we can't use it. Seems like sheet music. Sorry, sneezing. Combine with what? I don't have anything else to combine it with, but okay, this looks like we have to come back then. Interesting. Hmm. Oh no. You need a book I do not possess. We should go back outside. God, this place is big. And find another book. And this is another one up here. Hello. Oh, there's another one up there as well. Do you have a purpose? Ooh, note number two. Oh my, what is this? Alas, we found no noteworthy Remurian treasures other than nothing but more or a dozen ancient bric-a-brac from storehouses. If what the golden hunter said was true, then the we initially sought has long since sunk to the bottom of the sea alongside Capitolium. Is that what you called your city? Most of the relics here are from the golden troop, not... Regardless, we have not the time to retrieve the relics now. Our current priority is to seal this place. I've marked the location of the relics on the map, but perhaps someday. Is this where we are currently standing? So all the square rooms have something of note in them, but what I could not say. All the square rooms. One, two. Hmm. 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 I don't know. But you be orange. Uh, okay. Are we making steps? Oh, we're going higher. Oh god, the intrigue. We've got nothing else to do. What Why don't the I tell hell the story? happens to those? 
it duplicates and disappears and then it starts again and then it goes up does it continue from there or does it just go to there i've got to do the other seals i think yeah i've got to do the other seals wow this place is weird I'm assuming these are all golden troop belongings. Um, if I were to, thank you. I was about to say I don't, I can't get to it. What? I'm so confused. Where is the damn thing? Oh, there you are. Okay, so do I want this one or do I want the previous one? How about the hell we're here? 